Hello everybody! So lately I've been doing stuff with uh, Arduinos and one of the projects I wanted to use a Pro Mini. Um, online on Arduino's website they say the Pro Mini is for advanced users. But as I've set this up I really don't think it's it's for advanced users. It's super simple. And online there's just a ton of like 12 minute videos on how to set this up but I really don't think it's needed. The only difference between a Nano and a Pro Mini is the fact that the USB to serial interface is not on the chip. That's literally it. Um, that way you can get it a little bit smaller. Um, and maybe that might be useful for some of your projects. Um, so you do have to get a USB to serial interface or converter. Um, I got one. It's here. You can see it's an FTDI. And, and as I was looking at this, um, it's honestly super simple. I just have my jumpers, female to female, and you just can line them all up like that, and then hook them in. And I noticed that if you just take the cable, and then you flip it around like that, and you plug it in to the, oh geez, let me do this, to the Pro Mini, that all the pins will line up. Then you just got to make sure that if you have a 3 volt, you're doing 3 volt. If you have a 5 volt, you're doing 5 volt. And you don't blow things up. And then you just plug it in. Look at that. And then if I go up here and I upload a blink, you can see the RX and TX over here sending the data over to the Pro Mini. And what do you know? It's programmed. <laughs> and this is how they sent me the boards unsoldered. And I realized you don't even have to solder them or have the jumpers. You can literally pull this off. And if you connect the boards like this. See, they're connected. I can go over here. Oh, blink is already on there. But, and then you can just, you can literally program a Pro Mini without soldering on headers, without having jumper cables, anything. Like, you can, you can start developing without even having to do anything. So, don't let the whole advanced users thing scare you off. The Pro Mini is honestly just nicer. It has smaller form factor. It can still do serial communications and it's just nice. Well, I hope this helps out and now you don't have to watch 12 minutes of video. <laughs> Bye.